Moving forward now, one road that hasn't seen any traffic in more than 24 hours, Route 5S in Utica. But it's far from quiet down there. The State Department of Transportation and the Water Authority, they've fixed that massive water main break, but there's still a lot that needs to be done before that detour is lifted. Eyewitness News reporter Marley Tuskis brings us an update. We've had water main breaks before, but uh, this was pretty significant. It was a good sized pipe uh, and uh, happened to fall into an area where we had major traffic. Crews have been working around the clock since early yesterday morning, finally finishing repairs to the water main break around 4.30 a.m. today. They were able to isolate the water main itself, uh, which gave them the opportunity to excavate around it and then replace that section of water main. Uh, right now, it just seems like, you know, it's a 1912 pipe. Uh, it's old, and with the uh, cold temperatures, it just, you know, had a break. Now their concerns have shifted toward cleanup, ensuring the roads are clear of slush and ice, but also as a way to check that they're safe for travel. In the area of the water main break, you could see where it just kind of collapsed because of the water. Basically now, it's trying to uncover that this whole area so that we can look at the integrity of the pavement, make sure there was no undermining of the roadway. And if there is, we'll make those repairs. And once that's done, then we can start looking at opening up the road. Picola says it will take at least another day to assess the damage and make any necessary repairs before the roadway is reopened. We have almost 20,000 cars a day that go through this area with you know this intersection at John and Ariscany and 5S. So uh, it's, it's quite busy and it was quite an impact to the traveling public. In downtown Utica, Marley Tuskis, Eyewitness News.